a new European Union policy may increase pollution in the air and might make the food you eat diseased. This is Yardane Frankel with Honest Reporting. The EU is getting tough with Israel. They've said they will no longer permit any sort of grants to institutions that have a presence in the disputed territories or eastern Jerusalem. So, for example, last year grants were given to Israeli institutions that studied greenhouse gas emission or were trying to improve the quality of veterinarian inspections of livestock. But they were given to institutions that had branches in the disputed territories. According to the EU, they will no longer permit this because by banning this funding, they will further the cause of peace. Yeah, right. Does anybody think that punishing Israel by denying them these grants is going to promote peace? You may have seen this issue addressed in the media, but did the article that you read give real examples of the kind of funding that would be cut? Did it talk about the fight against pollution or to improve the quality of livestock? Or did it just mention Israeli settlements? You can demand better from the media. Join the fight against anti-Israel media bias. You can join Honest Reporting, it's free. Just click over here and we'll tell you what's going on in the world, what's going on with regard to Israel and what you can do. For Honest Reporting, this is Yardine Frankel. Thanks for watching and subscribing.